Meghan Markle will be skipping her maternity leave to attend a large amount of events this month, marking her unofficial return to the royal spotlight. Despite being just two months into her time off after giving birth to Archie Harrison Mountbatten Windsor in May, hello! Reports she will be likely to attend an array of gatherings and events in July. The 37-year-old is likely to attend Wimbledon to support pal Serena Williams, as she did last year with sister-in-law Kate, also 37. Archie's christening is also this month and believed to be taking place this Saturday at Windsor Castle. The ceremony will be at St. George's Chapel, where the Duke and Duchess of Sussex married 14 months ago. Less than 25 people will be attending and of those, it is unlikely any of Meghan's own family will be there following a spate of several rifts. In 1984 Harry was also christened at the same chapel. Meghan is also expected to be attending the glittering premiere of The Lion King in London. Buckingham Palace confirmed Harry will walk the red carpet at the glitzy event and his American wife could well attend too. A final decision is expected to be made closer the time on July 14. The news comes as Meghan and Harry face a growing public backlash over their constant attempts to keep part of their lives private, despite huge spending of taxpayer cash. Archie Harrison will be christened this weekend in the Queen's private chapel in Windsor Castle. Royal christenings are not usually open to the public, but are usually held in public venues where fans can see the guests and family arrive and leave the church. This decision is the latest step in Meghan and Harry's attempts to keep their baby's life as private as possible. The christening announcement came hot on the heels of the news that the Duke and Duchess of Sussex accepted £2.4 million of taxpayer money for the renovation of their new home. Royal author Penny Durer slammed the couple's decision to keep the ceremony private, saying they can't have it both ways after accepting the money. She told The Times, they can't have it both ways. Either they are totally private, pay for their own house and disappear out of view or play the game the way it is played. Seeing Archie and his godparents arriving at the christening is what people are interested in. Good Morning Britain presenter Piers Morgan added, this baptism should be public or the public should get their £2.4 million back. 